What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today I bring you one of the best masterwork core farms in the game right now. A farm which you should definitely be taking advantage of while you can. But before we go any further guys, if you do enjoy the video and would like to show your support, you can by hitting that like button. And if you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny 2 videos, be sure to subscribe. Now before we go absolutely anywhere, credit to Viper over on Twitter for the heads up on this. His method paired with my farming spot means hundreds of cores for sure among many other things. So basically what you need to do is have a full void set up. Special weapon, heavy weapon and super subclass. If you have raid banners or the means to buy them, go ahead and do so via Petra on the Dreaming City. Although they ain't necessary at all, I suppose they can help you. Then you need to load up the last wish raid. Within here, you need to teleport to Shiro Chi using the Wall of Wishes. If you don't know where this is, follow the route I take on screen now from the first raid encounter. Once you are in here, you are welcomed by this room of wall panels. Shoot the panels to match the image on screen now. This should take you about five minutes maximum. Once done and all is correct, stand on that center panel. You will then be teleported to Shiro Chi. Once you are here, rally a flag. This, as you know, will fill your entire stock of ammo and special abilities. Now just walk up to this door. The door will open and you'll be welcomed by a shit ton of taken ads. Using all your void means, Take these bitches out. You will notice you will start racking up taken butter and no taste ingredients among many others. But these are the two you want to farm for this method. So get as many as you want. I was literally here for 10 to 15 minutes maximum. Probably not even that and I got quite a few. Now once you have what you have, this is what you do. Using Eva's holiday oven, Create as many of the dark chocolate malts as you can. These take taken butter, no taste, along with the essence of dawnings, which I am guessing at this stage of the dawning event you have a ton of. If you don't, which is unfortunate, these are the places you can get them from and the amounts you are rewarded. But yeah, create as many of these as you can. Then you simply just head to the drifter in the tower and cash in your stock. You are rewarded all kinds of things from tokens to rares to legendaries and even exotics. These gifts can reward you absolutely all sorts, but you also get many, many masterwork cores for doing this. Like I said, this was about 10 to 15 minutes of farming, if that. You sit here for an hour doing this or an evening, the rewards will be absolutely crazy. You can also create other recipes with whatever else you have or are rewarded ingredient wise and cash those in too. The farm is basically unlimited depending on your time input, but the rewards are great for sure. Now this is obviously going to end when the dawning does, so use this while you can people. Farm, farm, farm away! The actual show tree farming spot with raid banners is great for farming every single second ingredient, so if you are in need of any second ingredient, as you have many of the first, which are basically for just killing certain enemy types, use this spot, obviously changing your loadout to match what ingredients you are after. But yeah guys, a simple way of getting cores among many, many other things. And on that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leave it a like, it really does help out. If you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny videos, like guides, top fives, gameplays, reviews, just about everything, make sure you subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video on upload, turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But again, thanks for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.